Hi, this is Richard from Scott Country International. Welcome to the Night Vision Show. Tonight I'm out foxing for a farmer who's losing chickens. For spotting purposes I'll be using the Infury Zoom ZH50 version 2 with this very unique zoom capability which we'll talk you through later. And for executing the shot I'll be using the Pulsar Thermion 2 LRF. So I look forward to getting some footage for you and let's see how we got on. Cheers. So I'm just arriving at the farm here and having a look round through the Zoom ZH50 and I'm taking advantage of the 25mm optical zoom here to get that real wide field of view and you can see it picking up all the heat signatures in the distance it's easily a thousand metres away so no problem with the 2600 metre detection range I thought what I'd do here is just, um, so I'm at 25mm, I zoom in now to 50mm on the cattle here, on these heifers. And you can see it's maintained its quality of picture on the zoom, looking at the animals closer. Going through the colour palettes now, white hot, black hot, red hot, colour in highlight mode and then zooming back out to the 25mm spotter range so really useful function so here I am on the 25mm lens in a spot a heat source zoom into 50mm you can clearly see that's a hair and away it goes into the distance next the spot this heat signature and in zooming in clearly identify it as a roe deer so that's not what we're after we're after the chicken killer and here it comes almost in the same route that the the roe deer took now i didn't zoom into 50 as soon as i see foxes i tend to get onto the rifle so this is me now onto the thermian 2 the Pulsar Thermion 2 and I'm, I've got a plastic mouth scooker with me and I'm just calling the fox in and really enjoying using the range finding capability on the Thermion 2 and I won't take the shot until I'm comfortable with the range I mean, just look at the picture quality on the screen there. That's me range finding now, just to check that it is getting closer. It's coming through the rushes just now, so you can't see it. It's obscured from vision, but it'll pop out any moment now. Here it comes. So you can see the quality of the, the clear, smooth image. Real high contrast on the heat sources, producing that brilliant picture. Which gives you that kind of upper edge when you're having to do fox control at night. Continuing to squeak away to get it in a wee bit closer. And dispatch this fox safely and securely. So this is it, the spotter I was using last night, the Zoom ZH50 version 2 from Infury, which comes with this really unique zoom system, going from a 25mm lens to a 50mm lens on one swing of that batten button on there. What it does do is it, it keeps its focus, so you're not having to continually adjust when you're trying to zoom into your quarry. So you spot on the 25mm field of view, uh, get a bit larger uh, screen picture to spot your quarry. And then when you want to target it, identify it up close and personal, zoom into 50mm for that more tunneled um, picture on your screen. 
So yeah, really unique um, and really, really innovative. So well done to Inferio on that. Some other facts around it. It's got a 12 micron sensor on it with an FD of 25 millikelvin. It's um, got a 640 by 512 high resolution sensor on it as well. It's got four times base magnification with a detection range of 2,600 meters. Now, something really useful on this bit of kit is the battery, which slots really easily in and out, this block battery. And you get 10 hours runtime on one battery and it comes supplied with two. So that's um, going to please a lot of people on there. Um, it's got ultra clear mode for when you're in heavy rain or, or misty conditions like we often get in the west coast of Scotland up here, then that's really useful just for cutting through and getting that extra quality and an, an enhanced picture. It's got five colour palettes on it, just the usual colour palettes as you would expect with a highlight mode in there as well. So yeah, I really like it. One of the things I did um, find really useful in the field was that um, every time I put it to my eye, it wasn't out of magnification. Sometimes you can bump the buttons and when you put it up to spot quickly, you're out of focus or you're on the wrong magnification because you've accidentally knocked it. These plastic buffers in between the buttons really play their part in stopping that happening. So that's some good, uh, a good design feature on there. Also the eye cup goes around to the right hand side. So at dusk, um, which is often when I'm seeing foxes or if I'm stalking as well, that just covers any light from getting in and a really good robust lens protector on your lens cap. So yeah, all in all, brilliant offering from uh, Infrared, really quite clever uh, the way they've designed this to have this zoom function and, and it really when it holds that picture quality it saves you messing about with the focus buttons. So yeah, really impressed. Um, so now onto the Thermion 2. So this is the Pulsar Thermion 2 Pro LRF because it comes with this range finding capability at the top. Um, which um, is really, really useful in the field, I must admit. As you saw me ranging that fox as it came in, you know, I've zeroed the rifle at an inch high at 100 metres, um, and to know exactly what distance that fox is at just gives you that extra confidence when you're, when you're taking your shot. So yeah, really, really impressive. The on-off switch for the scope comes at the back here of the rangefinder. Sturdy lens cap, as you would expect. Running through front to back, this is your functionality wheel here that takes you into the inner workings and the functionality of the scope. Um, you've got an extra um, storage for an extra battery in the top there and at the side is your charging port for your Type-C cable. Um, working to the back of the scope, it's got three simple buttons at the back. The bottom of the triangle is the uh, range finding button and you would have seen me clicking through that. Um, on the video. Um, this is your zoom button. Now once you press that you can either go up through the different magnifications or you can s s um, zoom in and smooth increments using this side wheel which is really nice, really good to use and you've got your record button at the right hand side if you want to record any videos onto your Stream 2 app on your phone. So yeah, um, impressive bit of kit. Loved using it and I'm going to be putting a lot uh, to a lot of good use over the next couple of weeks. Uh, Fox and it's got a range of up to a thousand, uh, 1,800 meters detection range and the laser range finder goes up to a thousand meters. So yeah, um, really impressed. Look forward to getting it out again over the next couple of weeks and getting more footage of it for you. Um, so yeah, looking forward to using it again. So this and the Infrared Zoom ZH50 that I've got in review just now, all these products you can have a look at on uh, Scott Country International's website. So that's www.scottcountry.co.uk. Go in and have a look. And if you want to phone the guys also, just pick up the phone to them and I'll chat you through their products or any guidance you need. So this has been Richard for the Night Vision Show and I look forward to seeing you all soon. Thank you.